it's not the tight ends, it's the option, and they happen to use him as the guy. So, and then 13 shovels for 75 yards. So, uh, the tight ends got all of them but one. We know the old put the show The player D line. How do you think they are? Hey, I think I hate. <laughs> <laughs> Dexter was terrific. <laughs> D tackles were solid. <laughs> Speaking of the, of the D tackles, you got some depth there, but how does the loss of Scott Pagano affect the interior? Well, it hurts. You know, Scott's a great leader for us, a tough guy. He's played real well uh, this year. And uh, we do have a little bit of depth there. And, uh, you know, you know uh, Albert Huggins got a uh, step up along with Jabril Robinson. In seriousness, what ways have you seen Dexter grow from the start of a season to where he is now? Oh, uh, I've just probably, I'm not that he ever lacked confidence, but assuredness in what he's doing and confidence from his teammates. And, um, uh, you know, he had two terrific plays and block uh, kicks uh, in the game. And has played, you know, real consistent for a young guy. You know, he's played real consistent, gets off blocks and makes plays. And, Probably he would say he's just gotten more and more confident as the season's gone along. We interviewed you Saturday night, and, you know, you often can't tell things. I mean, sometimes you can right after a loss. It's never as good as it seems, never as bad as it seems. What have you taken away Sunday, Monday, Tuesday from the film that you well, it's just maybe as much, didn't see? You, know, we, you have to play with discipline. We said that, you know, sat in this press conference a week ago and said the same thing going into the game, that it's a lot like option football. And lo and behold, they ran the inverted shovel option. And uh, we didn't stop the dive from the first drive. You know, we had two plays uh, on the first drive. After we, you know, in a three deep coverage, we jump a flap route and they hit it for 44 yards. They got them all charged up on the second play of the game. And then we, we were, nobody's tackling the dive. The dive player did not tackle the dive twice on that first drive. And as a result, it, uh, you know, it, it uh, you know, gave that play life the rest of the game. And uh, again, it's whatever it was, uh, 12, 13 times for 75 yards. That, that was their run game, and they kept us off balance all, the, all game long. So, uh, you know, when you cannot stop with the dive, you know, you're going you're gonna, to uh, just be hanging on. And that's kind of what I, th I thought that, that extended drives and gave them life and created some critical plays uh, during the course of the game that, you know, led to touchdowns. Brent, their horizontal stuff was pretty lethal coming in too. Was there does stopping that sort of come at the expense of the inside stuff? No, not there? at all. <laughs> when that tackle blocks down, that guy sits. That's it. And, and so the, the horizontal stuff, that guy wasn't making those plays. We got guys for that. And uh, so it didn't have anything to do with you. you read your key with discipline. You blocks down. You squeeze. You sit. It's as simple as it gets. I mean, we just didn't do it, you know. And, and uh, the other times, it's not just one guy, but uh, one guy had his hand in it uh, about four times. And then it's some other times they caught us. Uh, one time in particular, they caught us in a, a bad call. Uh, we hadn't worked. And they did a good job of giving it all kinds of different ways with different personnel groups, di different motions, different shifts. And uh, we were in some different calls. So, but, uh, but it's really, it's just fundamentals, though, too. How much of a barometer will Wake Forest offense be to gauge your improvement and the corrections that you've made? It's everything. I mean, we, we don't play well, we're not going to win. So, I, mean, I, I really don't care about gauging and all that. We, we need to play well. Well, based on, the, on the way that they, their offense is I don't, I, I, don't, I don't know what you mean. I, I don't know what you is, mean. It, is it very different from Pitt's Wake Forest offense schematically? Some it's of the, different. What are some of the ways in which they differ? They're more of a spread. They want to run the ball and, uh, and uh, you know, take their opportunities and throw it when it's there and get it out quick. And, uh, but uh, more ways 
different than, than not. It presents its own set of 